So, I've got Alexa. What yes. is the most challenging thing about the show? About the show? Getting ready to sing my first number. The pace of it. The dancing, but especially the beat. Losing people when you built relationships and gotten close to people on stage. I'm trying to make it fresh and real every single day. So you have to find new ways to make it interesting. Because I've been here for three years, so... It's after a while, you kind of want it to change a little bit. Not getting to be a part of that magic every night. Is any any lack of routine? Maintaining stamina. Eight shows a week, yeah. Two show days. Is the eight shows a week? But you never really have a weekend. The character herself, I believe, is a challenge. It's a challenge, but it's also what I love. Five minute call. All her changes in Act One are very fast. Well, this show is, is such high energy, so physically demanding because of all the dancing and the choreography that's going on. Remembering all the steps that they've told me it's like jumping onto a train, but a lot of the, a moving train, a very fast moving train. Every performance is different. So you kind of do little changes here and there just to keep it fun and interesting. By being Motormouth Mayville, I don't come into the show till the show is at the end of the show for the first half. When you um, are having a bad day and you have to go out there and, and make people laugh, that's hard. That's really hard. But it's also therapeutic too, so. But it's hard, you know, losing those friendships and little bits you have on stage. Oh. Carrying people throughout the show, it's really hard, you know? It, it is. I mean, step up your game, everybody. <laughs> 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 It's on tape I now. Totally it's like going into a, a well-trained cheerleading squad when you're just starting. I think being a swing is really hard in the show. Because if I'm on a lot, I get used to that. And then if I'm off a lot, it's always like a stop and start. I was kind of surprised how much it took out of me when I when I first joined the show, doing eight eight shows a week. You have to be pumped up and ready to sing big, blonde, and beautiful. It's, it's easy to fall back into a sort of like a, a almost a comatose state and just be like, this is what I do. You know, constantly changing and getting to know new people. Seeing uh, Kevin Meany semi-naked on a nightly basis. Which is great. It was a little bit scary. That's the biggest challenge. The theater. By the time we get to the beat at the very end of the show, you're tired and you're a little worn out. There's so many tracks to learn and they're all so different, but uh, making her a real person. It's live and it's fresh. It's a lot to do and it's a lot to uh, it's a lot to live up to, but at the same time it's really rewarding. And I love it. That challenge is is really worth it because the payoff is so big. I'm doing fine and having a great time. And no matter what I do, warming up my throat, doing jumping jacks, I still it's a challenge for me getting ready to sing it. But I always make it through. And you do it fantastically because even when I'm bored you get my attention when I do the laundry down there. And uh, what is the thing that you love the most about being in the show? About the show? I love the people in the show. The people. The cast. The cast. Everybody behind behind the stage. The crew. It makes it eventful and fun. The orchestra. The cast and crew are, are just wonderful people. The dressers. I love the the live audience part of it. Just coming here and being able to perform for for a great audience, and I get to be a star of a of a hit Broadway show. And I... the play itself, it's good. It's so good. good, and that's so rare. I get to work with such amazing people, and I love the fact that every performance is a, a fresh, a clean slate, and anything can happen. I love everybody at the show. I just, I love the girls' dressing room. I just love everybody in here so much. And the, the experience of live theater. I love the people. And it's almost like family. This company is really great. Rock. It's just a big family. That's the best thing, is all the interesting people you get to meet while you're here. Um, and, and the show itself is just, so, it's, it's the best show that I've ever worked on. To, to in some way be a part of this company and this, this show that I think is Magical. The show is so joyful that even if you come in in a bad mood, you're going to walk out of this theater just exuberant because you had such a good time. Every single person that leaves this theater is just filled with joy and that doesn't always happen. Every night we get a chance to be in front of a different group of two, almost 2,000 people and it's, um, it's, it's really rewarding and it's really cool. I love doing theater. The show is so great. You can't not have fun doing Hairspray. Music. You hear that? The yeah. orchestra. I mean the dancing every day. <laughs> the story of Tracy. It's such an amazing thing. If you have a dream, you can achieve it with persistence, no matter what people say. I am so lucky. I never tire of the music, the energy, the kids are great. 
and the backstage crews are all great. Uh, I love the fact that I can go anywhere in the building and, 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 and talk with people that I enjoy being around. And everybody, is, you know, makes it great to come to work every day. As crazy as it gets, we, we are the crazy people, but that's what makes it fun. Really, they do. I, I'm, I'm fortunate to be working with people that I enjoy as people, not just okay. as cast members. To do it on Broadway, which is the, you know, the best. And I get to sing 18 million songs. This, it's been my dream since I was a child, and finally, at the ripe old age of 84, <laughs> I get to be on Broadway. I get to make people laugh every day. And uh, years from now, when the, my son grows up, and God willing, he won't be an actor, but he might be reading into the history of theater, and he'll read about this show, and I can tell him that I was a part of it. The fourth floor has the best people in the show. Yeah, you go, girl. You go fourth floor. <laughs> yes, fourth yeah. floor. I'm all the way down to that basement. I don't <laughs> even have a cell phone reception. <laughs> <laughs> we love you, Darlina! Ciao! Love you too. I love you, Alexa! Take care, Alessandro! I love you, Isabella! I love you, Alessandro! Mwah. Thank you! Uh, Alessandro! Ciao. Ciao! Bye! Ciao, bello! Ciao, Babella! Ciao! Adios! Have fun's wedding! Thank Ciao. you very much! <laughs> Ciao! Bye! Ciao! Bye! Ciao! 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 Ciao, baby! Ciao, Bella! Ciao. Bye. Get ready for the second one. Okay. Ciao. Okay, thanks. You're a great dancer. <laughs> and you are the cutest ass on Broadway. Hey. <laughs> Holla. Hallelujah. Holla. And muzzle top. It, uh, that too. Ciao. Bye.